the papillion um i was so happy about this beautiful little tiny bag um what my husband had in mind for it was actually my glasses that i never keep up with so he thought it would be a cool feature to my louis vuitton collection to have my little sunglasses or actually my eyeglasses in here and me to keep them safe so um it was really surprising the reason why it surprised me so much because this was my first Louis Vuitton from my husband so it was really excited to see like what he would pick for me and why he would pick it and it Louis Vuitton is something really near and dear to my heart so that was super fun but a little review on the bag surprisingly um, it is my most worn Louis Vuitton bag, which is insane. I wear this bag all the time, especially because me and my husband go out on a lot of dates. We're newlyweds, so we go out on a lot of dates and a lot of outings. And I don't really take much with me. Um, I just usually take maybe my ID. I toss it in here, my car keys, and a little bit of my lip gloss to touch up my lips, and that's it. I just go about my way. Um, I like that it's super, super light, super convenient. Um, one of the other things that I like about it also is that it's unique. It is actually an accessory that comes with, um, the larger bag, which comes in three different sizes. So I really was never fond of that particular bag, the larger bag, but it's something so interesting and mystical about the tiny bag here. So I think that's why a lot of people uh, really t ask me a lot about it. Like, oh, like I've never seen the bag that size or, oh, it's so tiny. What do you fit in there? Or, oh, it's so cute. Um, a lot of mini bags are really popular right now. I think we're getting more interested in mini bags because they, um, are fun and you have more flexibility and versatility with them also they go with a lot of different outfits I think um, right now a lot of people are not into the huge big bag if you don't have to carry all that stuff you don't need to especially for a night out on the town with your girls or even you know a night out with that special someone in your life so um, it has the leather strapped here it's really 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 soft it's nothing like um, the actual traditional handbags that Louis Vuitton carries. Also, you will not find a serial number in the newer styles of this bag because they did they no longer put the serial numbers in these particular ones. The serial numbers were in the older design. So if it is in this bright red, the newer um, design in this one, you won't find the serial number. So do not panic that you do not see the serial number. Like, oh my God, it doesn't have a serial number. It's fake. No, it just doesn't have a serial number because it was created as just accessory for the Papillion larger bag. Um, another thing that I also noticed about this bag is the clip, which is pretty cool. Um, sometimes I actually clip this to um, my belt loops in my jeans, so I'll kind of have it go through and I'll just leave it hanging on the side and I get a lot of compliments that way that's just when I want to be like really like sporty and casual um also let me show you actually like what I actually put in the bag it has the LV on both sides of the clasp um also it has the LV both sides of the clasp here if you can buy this bag pre-loved because they do not sell it as a separate at the Louis Vuitton store. So the first thing I have inside the bag is my car key with um, my remote on there. The second thing I have inside the bag is like oh a receipt a mascara and the mascara um is really cool if you want to touch up you know your lashes also you can do like a lip gloss so you can you can keep a lip gloss and a mascara in there and then like i told you uh this is like the mouth size of a debit card um a card can fit in here and then i have some change and some coffee Oh, and an eyelash <laughs> change in a cough drop. I told you I do use this bag a lot. I, that's why you see all this crazy stuff in there. So this is the inside of the bag. 
it doesn't fit a lot but it fits enough it's perfect for date night um my biggest fear about this one is losing it it means so much to me because it was um a wedding gift from my husband and it was a big surprise and i knew he spent a lot of time because he kept asking the lady oh my god does she have this one i just want to make sure she doesn't have this one so i didn't have this one um so i thought this was really cool so if you guys like this um idea um let me know the price on this bag right now um is a little pricey it's really interesting because the papillion the the actual handbag the papillion um in the different sizes only ranges about four hundred dollars um on the pre-love sites so it's really funny because this by itself, the newer one, ranges about $3.99 is the highest that I saw it just for the Papillion Mini. Like, just for this tiny bag. So the tiny Papillion actually has more value than the actual large handbag. Um, I think a lot of the young ladies probably feel this way because this can be used as a wallet or a small... Um, or a small like makeup bag um, or just something you know like different also it can be hooked to the d-ring in your bag so if you want to put something more secure in it and you're able to find it quicker because you can just follow the leather strap down and you pick it right up especially in bags like your never fools so it's really interesting that how much this costs um, for it to be um, you know just an accessory that came with a bag so if you guys have any questions about this bag or um, interested in it, um, please let me know. I will put some pictures in it of how small it actually is, but it's absolutely beautiful um, and I love it. <laughs> and thank you again, Mr. Gill, which is my husband. So see you guys next time. Peace. Oh, yeah, we're going to wait for the kids, like, we're going to get me.